What's up YouTube, DP19 here with a collection opening. Bought a collection on eBay. Uh, thought, think I got it for a really good price. I wanna show you guys real quick what it was. Haven't done one of these or a mail day videos in a while. I figured I'd record it real quick while I had a little bit of time. Try to make sure not to show my address. Too lazy to get a sharpie so oh, nice big block of foam i'll actually keep it to use the space filler that package or something same thing with this bubble wrap okay, what kind of binder is this a regular binder ultra pro We got ourselves regular old ultra pro binder. Thinking probably makes more sense to just hold it like that. Let's see what's in here. I vaguely remember what's how the hell is that held on? Oh, it's from the back. I'm stupid. <laughs> Usually see the strap on the front. Well, maybe you could just switch it. No. Huh. Yeah, that's weird. It's backwards on this one. Not a bad binder, though. MetaZoo. Alrighty. Got the stickers going on there. So we got the pin promo cards. Got the hollows, non hollows. I'll look at conditions of everything later. Hollow promo. Oh, I did not know that was in there. Was that a snow snake? Hollow, that's a nice little extra I didn't know was in there. We got the medals, first edition ones. Is that first? Yep, all this should be first edition. Which is why I picked it up. Then we got the hollows and reverses. Reverse Bigfoot, I need that one. All the rest I do have. I bought this just for... It's around like $580 for everything. And when I did the math, like lowest possible was about mm, $1,000 worth. So I figured, eh, pick it up and get to get some holes filled. Walking sand, that one I don't have hollow, so hopefully it's in good condition. Loveland Frogman, just got that one. <clears throat> got all these. I believe I have Piazza Bird. I need the hollow, though. Uh, see, I, the tops cards weren't in the pictures, so it's all <clears throat> a cool, nice little sight to see. Promo Man of Alabama, I think, maybe a hat, yeah, I think I have that one. These two I do not, one of the obnoxious nines, both these, Growth and Pile for Red. Hope those are both in good condition. We have these two I recently picked up, and then, uh, some of these I don't have, like these two I don't believe. Chaos Crystal I definitely don't have. Have that one, then this one I don't have. Recently picked this one up for like a dollar plus four bucks shipping. <clears throat> Thought it was pretty good. And then we have these. Don't believe I have that one or these two or the reverse. I did order some and I regretted doing that once I bought this. These are all hollows, reverses. Should be Mothman. It's decently priced, like 10 bucks. Any of these reverse, like uncommons and commons, I didn't really account for. Just kind of like extras. Hopefully I'm doing a decent job recording it. I keep looking at the cards and not necessarily the camera. Oh, and then we have these, the complete set. Those are Christmas second edition promos. Cool. And we got these two New Year's promos. And we need to have a, not a complete set, but we have a ding, ding bell. So ding bell on a shelf. That's what it is. Don't have the star. I don't remember what it was called. <clears throat> then we got these, which I was pretty happy to pick these up. Three Headless Horseman Hollows. Two Wendigo. It was open for three, but, you know, better than nothing. <laughs> then we got the Piazza Birds, Peach Rings. Got those two. We got that one. Then we have some of the more pin clubs. This is the Nightfall Edition. I have all these, but nice to have uh, some extras. I'll sell them if it's not in the best condition. Where's the rest a lot of empty pages all right 
<clears throat> we have Riptide Ruler, which I ordered, but I never got in the mail yet, so I might need that one. We have some, a reverse and a non-hollow. We have the hollow, reverse, and regular. We have the non-hollow and reverse, and we have the two reverses and regular hollow. Not regular hollow, the regular rare. And we have... Is that a hollow? I believe it is. Yeah. Let me just check it real quick. Oh yeah, definitely hollow. Yep, definitely hollow. That's another reason I picked it up. So I think they're going for like 70 bucks right now, 60, 70. Really cool. Big chunk of what I paid for it. We have just some hollows from the set. I have pretty much all of them, and hopefully I'll have a video for you guys soon on a complete set. Just need a couple cards to come in. That one I actually need, but I just ordered it, so we'll see. River of Time, that's a good one. For some regular rares. That one's a decent one. And then we have some rever- Ooh, Dover Demon, yeah, I need that one too. So I just, once again, I just ordered that one as well. Probably should have checked on this one before <laughs> I ordered those. And same thing with that one. Ordered it as well. Already have it. <laughs> On the way, at least. I notice I've been ordering a lot of cards I already have, which is kind of annoying, but. And we have Headless Coal Mine. I like that one. Stalactites look cool. And we have these. These are all first edition, right? Yeah, just some extra ones, kind of. Looks like. And I believe that's the last bit. And yeah. I think that should be about it guys so let me know what your favorite part of the collection was do you think it was worth the purchase of around six hundred dollars was more for most of the values than like the first edition stuff from the base set of it and then you got you know the windigo and whatnot so extra extra price that one's like 50 60 dollars so yeah let me know guys what you think i think it's a cool binder gonna fill a lot of holes have a lot of extras so i might sell some of them i don't know yet gotta go through them in low condition so i will catch you guys later peace